There is a volcanic comet called 12P Ponsbrooks. Uh, yes, volcanic. The volcanism can be solid, liquid, and gas. We have in this case gas formed from directly from the uh, solid, solid ice in a comet. Comets are made of ice and the rocky sandy material. Ponsbrook had a sudden eruption in July and again in October, just a few days ago. And now it is bright, 50 times brighter, fifth magnitude, five magnitude brighter than what it was. And it gets closer to the Earth, it gets brighter. It will get brighter. Some have suggested it looks very odd shape now. We know that shape from the comets like the Yokotake. Some say that this is a spacecraft. But we know that this is the solar wind acting with the uh, surface of the comet, creating the, you know, the heat and the heat and the evaporation and the explosion eruption of the ice directly from solid to the to the gas releases a lot of dust into the surrounding environment of the comet creating these bright uh, tails that we see in them the surface you see evidence plenty plenty of resurfacing visible at the surface debris the smooth surfaces that covered as if with the ash these are the dust from the comet spread over the surface even you can see a vent that's a volcanic vent similar to that the comet will be visible around the springtime in the constellation around the constellation of the orion moving fast toward the east from the west setting sun and as you can see here the orbit will be very visible and very favorable for us and the magnitude will uh, increase fifth magnitude have increased in brightness already. It may even have more burst. As it gets closer to the sun, it will be visible. During a solar eclipse in the Americas, you can see this actually fascinating time to be 8th of April 2024. It's an exciting time for both professional and amateur astronomers to see two phenomena at the same time in the sky.